it was terrible. It was like the flu times 10. I mean, it really was. The pain, the body aches were really, really bad. But it was no flu. Paul DeWise, a double lung transplant recipient, was sick with something much worse, COVID-19. Soon after, he became widely known around Michigan, though not by name. We're here today because we have identified the first presumptive positive case of coronavirus in Michigan. Paul developed a fever and then an upset stomach and terrible body aches. Given his health history, he was worried about the outcome while quarantined and closely monitored at Michigan Medicine in Ann Arbor. And here I sat in my hospital room all by myself. No one was allowed to come and visit me. I was in quarantine. And, you know, talking to my wife on the phone, it was terrible. I mean, it was just terrible. But Paul pulled through, never even needing a ventilator. Doctors say that double lung transplant may have helped Paul win this fight, too. I did get the best results. Unfortunately, there's a lot of people that haven't. Obviously, that's really great to see because when Paul was first diagnosed, although we didn't know him by name, he represented such a turning point for our state. Happy to report that he is slowly getting back to normal. He's even able to start doing things that he did prior to getting diagnosed, like exercising statewide as of about six days ago. And that's the latest data we have. More than 430 people have recovered from COVID-19. Reporting live this morning, Jen Schantz, 7 Action News.